The mouth is the gateway to the entire body, meaning that overall health begins with dental health. But at the height of the COVID pandemic, some essential dental services were put on pause since, well, sometimes dentists need to get all up in your mouth to see what's going on. And that's why the Cleopatra White Dental Clinic was especially renovated for the safety of patients and professionals. The Minister of Health, Michelle Shabbat, was at the inauguration today and explained that dentists are at risk every day during the pandemic. Because of the, the COVID-19 pandemic, many of our services, other services apart from the streamlined uh, COVID services had to be put on hold um, because of the exposure for the doctors and the patients. And because of the close proximity with which dentists work with patients, it is very, very high risk. And so the, the dental services were put on pause for a while. Um, but with the numbers having gone down, uh, we, we felt it was important to start providing the other services. And with this um, clinic having been really uh, newly renovated, we felt it was time to reintegrate those services. The senior dental surgeon, Dr. Rafael Samos, lamented some of the other issues the dental health sector has faced in the pandemic. As borders were closed and procurement of essential material were interrupted by the pandemic, the dental department had to reduce its services in keeping with the World Health Organization standards of reducing all aerosolized procedures. But despite those challenges, Dr. Samos highlighted that the number of Belizeans accessing dental services has almost quintupled in the last decade. In Belize, over the years, the population of persons accessing dental services has increased, and as such, there is a greater demand. From a population of 29,000, which was recorded in 2009, it increased in 2019 to 41,236 patients accessing the 10 dental clinics countrywide. Five programs are running, Outcare care Patient Program, MCH Program as mentioned by Nurse Guerra, Prison Program, education, Dental Education to the Urban Schools, and Mobile Outreach to the Villages. Courtney Menzies, 7 News.